while there are two ways to perform a factory reset on a Google Nest Wi-Fi Pro router. Google recommend that where possible, we perform a factory reset from within the Google Home app. If we open the Google Home app and select Devices, we should see our Nest Wi-Fi router listed under the grouping that we assigned it. Let's return to Favorites and select Wi-Fi. Within the Wi-Fi panel, we will find a number of options, including Network Settings. If we click on Network Settings, and then scroll to the bottom of the page, we will find an option called Factory Reset Entire Network. Let's select Factory Reset. When performing a factory reset, we will remove our wireless network from the Google Home app. We will also wipe all settings from our Nest Wi-Fi router and any wireless access points that we may be using as part of a mesh network. Let's select Factory Reset. Our router will now begin to perform a factory reset. So while our Nest Wi-Fi router has been removed from the Google Home app, we will need to wait for up to 10 minutes while our physical hardware is reset. If we jump over to our router, you will find that the status light on the router changes from being solid white to flashing white as our router reboots before eventually changing to a slow pulsing blue light to signify that our router is ready to be set up. It is also worth noting that while the router is performing its factory reset, you should not remove the power from the device. Instead, if you are looking to reset up your router or switch it off, you should wait until your router has been removed from the Google Home app and its status light is slowly pulsing blue. The alternative way to factory reset a Google Nest Wi-Fi Pro is from the device itself. However, as we mentioned earlier, this is not recommended by Google. We suspect the reason for this is that if our router is not connected to the internet, when we factory reset via the device, the Google Home app will not correctly deauthorize our Nest Wi-Fi network. This in turn will then leave a ghost instance of our old Wi-Fi network in the app, which cannot be removed until Google automatically remove it for us. So if you find yourself in a situation where you're unable to factory reset from within the Google Home app, if you flip over your router, on its base, you will find a reset switch. As the rubber is very thick, we recommend that you use a pen with its lid on to press and hold down the reset switch until the status light on the front of your router changes to a solid yellow. After holding down the reset switch for roughly 12 seconds, you can release the reset switch. Your router will now perform a factory reset and instruct any Wi-Fi points on your mesh network to also factory reset. You should find that the status light on the front of your router will start to flash white. Then rapidly flash blue before finally changing to a slow pulsing blue. At this point, your router will have completed its factory reset and will be ready to either set up or power down.